This is how down bad dudes are on TikTok. Gorgeous, marry me please. Very beautiful, I really want to hug you. Now usually these guys on TikTok are roasting these chicks, but let's try Instagram. Let's see if it's any better. Big, 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 very big, big, big. Well, as we see, clearly not. Sim culture has absolutely played the digital world and me, Austin Dunham, I am here to put an end to it. So in this video, I'm gonna tell you three reasons why you should never simp again. And if you feel like you're about to simp at any moment, just come back to this video, all right? Subscribe, like, let's go ahead and get right into it. So with TikTok, like I said at the beginning, it's a breeding ground for simps. Every single video, there's some girl who's baiting some simp blue pill guy for his attention. And I see it every time I scroll on my For You page, right? Every other video, some girl shaking her ass, um, posing in a bikini, doing some dance trend with all her goodies out. Like you guys have seen it too. And you guys probably have liked those videos and or commented on them. That is why TikTok consistently feeds you that type of content to your For You page and your algorithm. So the first thing you have to do is change your algorithm. Overall, stop engaging with this sort of content so that you see it less. Now, not only is this content bad in regards to you giving away your attention for free, but also it can lead to you failing your nofap or like leading into uh, a fapping situation because think about it, the TikTok and Instagram, all these pictures, all it truly is is like softcore porn, right? It's literally just softcore porn. So with that being said, a lot of guys find themselves watching this sort of content and then immediately clicking open Safari. And I've seen the comments too, like this is a real thing. So stop engaging with that content first, engage with content that will actually help you improve, help educate you or just simply entertaining for you. Now for my guys out there who wanna still like and comment on these girls' pictures and even to follow IG models who don't even follow them back, here's the first thing I need you to realize is that number one, you literally gain nothing from it, right? You think about it, you literally gain nothing from it. That like, that comment, that follow is not gonna get you in any great light with this particular woman. It is not gonna get you in bed with this particular woman. The guy who she's actually sleeping with is not in her likes, is not in her comments. Shit, he probably doesn't even follow her. Like I said before, you're literally just giving away your attention for free. And then these women, they just thrive off the free attention and that's how they've literally built their businesses. That's how they built their followings. Everything is by leveraging their goodies for the free attention of men who literally don't know any better. Number two, you're feeding her ego and making her less respectful towards men and overall men in general, right? And you guys are wondering, oh, why do women flake on me? Why is she ghosted me? And why does she not respect me? Blah, 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 blah. It's simply because these guys on social media, including yourself to some degree, the fact that she receives so much free attention, likes, comments all the time, um, guys pedestalizing her, she's gonna start to respect men less and less naturally. We've seen it a thousand times. And that is why the women who do respect men the most usually have good relationships with their fathers and do respect them. And number two, are not IG models, are not receiving a uh, hell of validation on social media. I've noticed even in my own dating life that those types of women do tend to respect men the most. So with every like you give a girl, with every comment you post, with every follow you give without any sort of anything back, just know that her overall respect goes about 2% for every single person to the point at this point is, is clearly past 100%. She, she doesn't respect men at all. That's probably why she's still single. Absolutely, alongside with the other factors about her personality, her life that are just overall unattractive to the men she actually likes. You think the men she actually likes is doing the scent behavior? Like I said before, it's not happening. The dude's probably not even following her. Now hear me out for a second. Think of a time that you simped and it actually worked out. Think of a time where you, you commented or consistently validated or messaged a girl constantly in her DMs just talking to yourself and it actually worked out for you. You were like, man, my persistence, even though she wasn't showing me any attention, it finally got me somewhere. All those follows and likes and comments I left on her for now a year and a half, now we're together. Right, think about it, it has never worked out. Even me, myself, right, I'm a man too, right? I like visual stimulation. But even me, myself, I have to start thinking more logically whenever I see this type of content on my For You page or whatever. Before I go and mm, 
like something, or you definitely won't see me commenting or anything unless it's like a debate rega regarding female to male intersexual dynamics on TikTok. You'll find me in those video comments, but you'll never see me commenting underneath the video of a girl who's twerking in a bikini. You'll never see me commenting, marry me, or oh, you're so gorgeous, you're so beautiful, can you be my wife or let me fly you out? I don't even fly women out in my own personal dating life. I can't do it, I can't do it. That's how like stringent I am about just this non-simping movement. I don't, I don't even think flying a chick out is simping, to be honest. I just still refuse to do it based on the level of risk that could happen, even if the woman is attracted to me. So that, that's a whole nother story, a whole nother video. You might have to check the Patreon for, for that one. So with that being said, guys, I offer you a challenge to end this video. The challenge is, is to rechange your algorithm, like I said before, and then from there, this next month, just next 30 days, guys, no comments, no likes off a woman who's trying to bait you for your free attention, right? Think about it, us men can literally change Instagram. We can change social media if we just stop giving away our free attention. Now the world will probably come falling down about the same time. Like, they just think about how great of a place it would be, how much more women would respect us, etc. All right, so embarking on this challenge with me, I've been doing it for months, if not years already. But at the same time, for you guys who are following women who are not following you back, unfollow them right now. Go in your following, unfollow them right now. Unfollow every IG model. Unfollow every girl you try to talk to, but she doesn't want to meet up with you. So you're just following each other on Instagram, or you probably just follow her. Unfollow them. If it's not giving you entertainment value, productivity, education, or just overall self-improvement and helping you become a better man, unfollow them right now. If you actually wanna stop simping and get a real woman in your life who actually value your time and attention and isn't a blood-sucking leech when it comes to it, then check out my Digital Romeo 12-week mentorship. I'll leave a link down below to where you can start building your own unlimited dating pipeline filled with women who are actually into you and want to be around you, right? So all links will be down below. Subscribe, like the video. I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. Peace. Thank you.